So the Queen Mother Champion chase next in and all of the rain we've had during the day has resulted in the ground now officially being changed to heavy. So that could make some difference for this second really big race of the festival isn't it after the champion hurdle earlier in the day and the field is headed by armed warhead for Paul Rhodes, Blanc de Noir, Darren Thompson, famous poet Stu Gray, Gorilla Driller, Leon Van Rensburg, James Queenfisher, Derek Hinton, Kingdom of Colts, Joshua Sutherland, Sea Fever, Martin Leadham, Drury Lane, Graham Clutterbuck, Madison Page, David Robertson, Orange Now, Molly at Surfer and Penny Fiction, Ghost Zapper, they're away and racing, the rain's coming down again, the ground is liable to get heavier still as the week goes on, the rain looks forecast for the whole week and Penny Fiction, the grey gets into the lead and gets over it nicely and Ghost Zappa, John Morgan will be hoping that this one jumps a little bit better than Rambling Rhapsody did earlier on in the day. Penny Fiction is the leader by six lengths to Gorilla Driller in second. You can see it's got a lot murkier since the earlier races as they skip over the second. Colours not so bright or anything now as the gloom descends across Cheltenham and they come towards this next one and over it they go. And that's the one in front of the stands and that'll be the last next time round then as they make their way out there now for a complete circuit and Penny Fiction has got a clear lead of a good six length and is not hanging about wants to get back in the dry out of the rain it would seem and he's going nicely in the lead from Grilla Driller second then comes Drury Lane and Madison Page with Arn Warhead on the outside Orange now behind them and Blanc de Noir tucked on the inside then Sea Fever as they take the fourth and they're all over that one okay with Famous Poet struggling a little bit towards the back. Penny, uh, Penny Fiction's lead then is down to three or four as they take the water. Be careful that water doesn't overflow before the week's up. Uh, Penny Fiction's in front. So Gray's one and two then net as Madison Page has moved through into second. In orange now as they take this ditch and there's a fall of this two fallers there. Sea Fever and Blanc de Noir have both gone up that big ditch. I think they were separate falls as they take the next one and over that one, the remainder got over it okay, and Penny Fiction still setting a strong pace to Armed Warhead, who's second on the outside of Orange Nair. Then Gorilla Driller's got the inside. Madison Page has dropped back a bit. Droy Lane's on that one's outside. Famous Poet is trying to creep into it. Kingdom of Cultures next as they take that one with James Queenfisher, the back marker of the remaining nine, as they make their way towards the next then. And over this one they go, and the leader is Penny Fiction. Penny Fiction's over it in the lead from Kingdom of Cult second. Orange Nair is third. Then Drury Lane is fourth. Now making some good move around the outside is Madison Page again. Armed Warhead still there, just been given a bit of a breather by the jockey. Gorilla Drill is being scrubbed along. James Queenfisher still at the back. Over the tenth they go. And it's still Penny Fiction. They've got to get to this leader. Penny Fiction's in front from Drury Lane. Madison Page, Orange now. And there's not much more than four and a half furlongs to go then now. And Penny Fiction is about to be joined by Drury Lane. Drury Lane comes up on the outside. Over the third last. Penny Fiction's over it in front. Then comes Drury Lane. Gorilla Drill, a kingdom of cult. He's making great progress around the outside and now looks a big danger to the leader. It's Penny Fiction still in the lead though, but here comes Kingdom of Colts and Kingdom of Colts might be just in front now. Kingdom of Colts as they take this left hand turn. Kingdom of Colts wide on the track but still in the lead. Kingdom of Colts from Penny Fiction. Orange now is running on them. Madison Page. Gorilla Drill is not out of it yet either. They come down towards the final two fences now. And over that one, a good jump on the inside by Penny Fiction. He's got back into the lead. Drury Lane's looking for room. It's Penny Fiction back in front again. Suddenly Kingdom of Colts looks beaten over the final fence they go and Penny Fiction gets over it well, gets away from it well, kept a little bit in reserve, races into the final furlong, the one up the centre of the track now coming to change his arm warhead but Penny Fiction's got three lengths up on all of them and up towards the line, Penny Fiction is going to take this one somewhat cosily in the end and up towards the line, Penny Fiction thinks it's going to be close for second, might be just Driller Driller or Arm Warhead, Orange now after that one and Famous Poet will come round in his own time at the back. But it's Penny Fiction for Ghost Zapper. Led pretty much all the way, headed in the straight, but came back and took it in fine style from Arm Warhead, second for Paul Rhodes, Grilla Driller for Leon Van Rensburg, third. Orange Nam, Molly at Surfer was fourth, and Kingdom of Cults for Joshua Sutherland was fifth.